Uh, I really thank uh, from the core of my heart to ICCI Bank for uh, honoring us on this Senior Citizen Day. By the way, I am a senior citizen by 10 months and 11 days. Just as, since I was, I am a doctor, I retired as a doctor, so I will uh, uh, talk about something. very important uh, as far as health is concerned. Some data about the senior, senior citizens in the world that in 1949 the average age of people in world was 48 years which was around uh, uh, say 71 years right now and in some countries like Monaco it is 84 years. As far as India is concerned uh, the average age was 62 in 2000. Uh, 2000. And now in 2021, this average age is 68 years. So this is what I want to say that uh, this day is was started in 1991. But in 1988, the president of America, who started when he was 77 years, when he uh, when he uh, completed his term, President Ronald Reagan of America started a campaign. He signed a proclamation called 5874. This proclamation decided to honor all senior citizens on 21st of August every year. So it is now 36 years back now, but first day was celebrated in 1991. Now the problems which we face as senior citizens, the most common is health issues. The health issues is that the day by day the non-communicable diseases like diabetes, hypertension, cancer, stroke, chronic kidney disease, non-alcoholic fatty liver disease and chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. These have taken the toll and 68% of the worldwide deaths are now occurring because of non-communicable diseases. So we have to take care of these and we should give a lot of time at this age for exercise and our dietary uh, lifestyle modifications, particularly dietary control. And another important thing is financial issues. Since I am a government servant, I am having pension. But those people who are not who are not in service and who are senior citizens, they have no source of income. But uh, there are certain government uh, issues uh, like the article of uh, family pension yojana and so many others they should take. But really, it's very financial problem in old age. Particularly those who are not government servant, it is very difficult to sustain them. Another important issue is social obligations. So social problems are there. People uh, don't uh, attend the social functions. I personally feel all elder senior citizens should attend the society functions and because they feel isolated and they are not welcome at home, particularly after 70 or 80 years. And, and they are given this a small room, particularly at 70 years, you will find that there are grandsons, granddaughters, and old man is relegated to a very small room where not, not even AC is available. This is a state of affairs in a particular area in uh, uh, families. Uh, even from wealth to families, we are finding from wealth to families, gazetted officers, the parents uh, residing in the old age home. So this is a uh, this is this is a reality too from the modern world, which I wanted to share. Another important is legal issues. At this age, I find many people are involved in legal issues. There are two sons, and they have a dispute, and their parents are involved in the legal dispute. So this, the legal help is also required at this age. Uh, similarly, there are other so many factors, but I feel this uh, is a great uh, privilege by ICC Bank to have honored all of us on this very day and uh, recognize that what are the problems which we are facing and uh, really at uh, conclusion I say be uh, happy, stay happy, uh, take little time for exercise and for personal time. Don't spend much time with the responsibilities of sons and daughters, let them do their work and just you play with the grandsons and that's all and granddaughters and let them their parents uh, take their all responsibilities and your personal life is more important at this stage when at 40 years you know the body cells start decaying everyone after 40 years and at this age i think one should keep healthy at all costs thank you very much